Hello everybody! Welcome to Les Stram. Today we're playing some Sploon. Splatoon 2. I'm calling it Sploon. Don't worry about it. Um, so today's just gonna be super chill. Uh, I'm gonna be playing some Turf War. Just to kind of like have a more relaxed Splatoon experience because I've kind of been doing a lot of ranked recently and I was getting a teeny bit salty. Just a little bit, just like a teeny tiny little bit salty. So we're just gonna chill out today with um, some Turf War <laughs> and try and not be salty. Although there's plenty room for salt in Turf War when we have party squids, which I don't personally understand. However, each to their own, we'll try and not get mad. Um, hello Zelda fan, I've been well thank you. Yeah, I mean well-ish. I sort of had to take a break from streaming um, just to kind of give myself a mental health break. But I'm feeling a bit better and the release of the new Animal Crossing has definitely uh, hyped me up a bit more to hopefully get back into streaming regularly because that would be great. Um, Earth and Tiger, hello. Blazing Phoenix, hello. Chase and Dan, you're here. Um, there is a salmon run. Which I'm not doing today, but I just want to see um, what the gear is. Man, look at my look at my inkling. <laughs> she looks great. Um, oh, it's the Squid Research lab coat. Man, I'm gonna have to play that later. I think my Squid Research lab coat doesn't have quite the gear I want, or quite the ability I want. So let me have a look see. Um, Ink saver main. I don't know. We'll we'll have to think about this one. But the squid research lab coat is pretty cute. Like, look at that. <laughs> um, cool. Let me just. I need to go get a drink. Not in real life. I do have a drink in real life. Um, in the game, I need to go and grab. Oh no, I drank already. <laughs> I'm already drunk. I have coins, let's go. You don't think you have the coat yet? I think I got every piece of gear and obviously it's now in rotation. So I think it's just a case of getting the right Grizz Coat ability but because there's so many clothing items, I don't think there's that many combinations that you can't get. Because my ultimate goal is to try and get every brand ability combination possible on every piece of gear. <clears throat> So for Grizzco, I try and pick things that I know aren't compatible. But for Ink Saver Main, Splash Mob has a lot of stuff. So I don't think Ink Saver Main is really necessary. We shall see. If anyone wants to play Sploon, feel free to jump into my matches. <clears throat> um, I'm right now I'm trying to get orange flags on everything. So this isn't like completely chill Sploon, like I still want to win. Um, but I'm mainly leveling gear and if I can get orange flags on weapons, that's like a bonus really. Oh man. Oh well. <laughs> so this is an ink rush. I don't remember which ink rush this is, but um, it's one that I don't have orange flag yet. So we're playing this. Um, also let me know if all the audio levels are fine. I did some tests and it seemed to be okay. I used to have this problem where um, it, Streamlabs OBS is fine but it sometimes doesn't remember settings or if you do settings you have to restart it to get the settings to get effect. Um, and because I have a delay um, on my mic and stuff because of Delgato there's like a thousand millisecond delay. Um, oh, I think there is a little bit of lag. That's okay. Um, yeah, sometimes it doesn't sync up properly. So hopefully it's all good. Because <laughs> I've had times where I've done the test and um, then I've gone to... <laughs> then I've gone to like record it and it's fine and then I try again and it's not. So like, this is just an, an, ever, an ever growing anxiety that I have. <sighs> okay, I did something. Good news. <sighs> Oh, just got them. Feels bad though. Oh man. 
I'm panicking so much unnecessarily. Who's over here messing with our spawn? <laughs> Zero awareness. Man, I, I do like ink brushes. I, I think I probably prefer the octo brush. However, the, the speed, the fact that you can just run in, mess with someone and run out, it's pretty good. Um, let me tidy this up here. I actually have kind of mixed feelings about this stage. Because I like it, but I think it's too big, personally. Um, I think it's just there's too many levels. I like that this middle ground area, I think it's really cool and everything. But I just think there's too much of it, you know? Okay, ooh. I'm not quite good at <laughs> pressing the button fast enough. I'd be okay. There's some trouble up top here. Let me go see if I can help. Mystic Land. Oh no, there's two of them. Help! At least let me get one. Where is he at? You can't catch me! Ugh. Fair. I will take the trade. <laughs> Audio seems fine. Great. You're gonna join? Okay, cool. <laughs> no worries. Honestly, like, I want to get my orange flags, but I don't really care. Like, I am... Jeez, man. S surprising. Okay. Oh, jeez. See now, they haven't even gone to their right side to colour all that in. And we didn't really. Like, our roller went over there and that was okay. I got 11 kills that game. For participations. Although I think they might just be me. We're doing good. Let's continue on, shall we? Do, 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 do. You're editing Luigi's Mansion 3. Nice. Now you're splatting. Cool. Man, I don't have um, Luigi 3. Um, I will buy it. I never played 2. Wait, is it Dark Moon in PAL or 2 in PAL? I can never remember. Alright, you guys got in. This is great. Um, I can never remember which... If we're Luigi's Mansion 2 or if we're Dark Moon. I never mind. <laughs> um, I haven't played it regardless, the 3DS game. Um, but I'll definitely get 3 at some point. I have a huge to-do list on Switch. It's unreal. Um, I have so many games to play. Um, stupid. And I keep buying them. You know? <laughs> oh, look at this team. Nice. Yeah, I just keep buying Switch games. And you know, I'm not actually like finishing any of them because I have so many and so many of them are like these huge RPGs. Like I bought Nino Kuni recently. Um, on Switch. I own it on PlayStation 3. I own the special edition actually on PS3. Um, which is great, but I wanted it on Switch because RPGs on Switch is like where it's at. Um, I know for a fact I'm getting Octopath Traveler finally for my birthday, which is in April. Um, which is a game you can get a lot cheaper on other platforms, but I went ahead and got a physical copy, or it's what I've asked for, and I have con confirmation that it will be received um, on my birthday. So yeah, Octopath Traveler, oh my gosh, <laughs> I think that was supposed to be a surprise attack, but they misjudged it. <laughs> but yeah, my, my Switch to-do list is stupid. So many games. And then Animal Crossing is going to come out and just ruin any chance of me ever playing anything else on my Switch ever again, so... <laughs> like, New Horizons is just... Whew. It kind of feels like... I've been trying to not think about it as much as possible, right? Because I'm so excited for it and I was like, oh, it's not out till March. You know, that's, that's such a, a long time. Um, but now that we're in March and I'm allowing myself to think about it, I'm now feeling sort of incredibly anxious and because I'm ant anticipating it. Like I'm genuinely feeling like nervous about it because I just want it to be good and I, I want to like 
hopefully stream it and stuff so there's that aspect that I want to go really well. So I'm, I'm actually feeling quite anxious about it in really good ways though. Oh, it's a really good charger player. Um, dang. So yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm anxious, but I get anxious about everything. <laughs> so like, it's fine. Um, I just, I'm just really hopeful that things are gonna go well. And it's out real soon, so. Man, it's all happening on that bridge, holy crap. I'm trying to think. Um, I have a switch, um, like, to buy list. Um, cause I also, I haven't bought Dragon Quest Eleven yet. Um, I'm just kind of waiting for it to be a good price and also just a month where I'm not buying lots of games. Because this month, um, I didn't get Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX that came out. Um, but I am getting New Horizons obviously and I'm getting Persona 5 Royal as well. So March is quite busy for video games. Um, See, so yeah, I have this this to buy list. So like Dragon Quest Eleven's on there. Um, I think I'd probably like to get Mystery Dungeon at some point. Luigi Mansion Three is on there. So yeah, Switch is just so busy all the time. Almost leveled up my shoes. All right, let's go again. Well done, team. Yes. So Luigi Mansion Two and Pal, thank you, friend. <laughs> I always forget. I don't know why. I think it makes sense. It makes more sense now that there's three that it's just called two, but I think Dark Moon is a cool name. Um, is this all the same players? Yeah, I think so. Might need someone to drop out for another space. Hello, the number E. I hope you're doing well. Welcome. Burr, 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 burr. So I need to win two more matches in a row to get the orange flag on this ink brush, which I think is doable. I'm doing okay actually with this. You're getting Animal Crossing New Horizons 2. Oh wow, your first Animal Crossing game Zelda fan? That's so, I think I've seen that a lot. People saying they've never played Animal Crossing and they're um, gonna play it for the first time with New Horizons. And that kind of like blows my mind because Animal Crossing is one of those series that I kind of assume everyone plays even though I think it's still fairly niche. And it's also a game that it's so hard to explain what it is to people who don't know. And I think a lot of people, they might use the comparisons of, oh it's kind of like Harvest Moon and it's kind of like The Sims. But in reality it's, it's, it's this completely unique experience. Um, and it's so special and beautiful and it's its its, its own thing so it's, and it's also called Animal Crossing which if you don't know what Animal Crossing is and someone says to you like oh what are you playing and you're like oh it's Animal Crossing they're like what? <laughs> I think like they don't automatically make the sort of um, zebra crossing connection or whatever or pelican crossing I don't know what other kinds of animal crossings there are. Zebra and pelican? There's probably more. Um, but yeah, I'm really interested in finding out like how people approach Animal Crossing who they've never if they've never played it before. Because to me that's just like absurd almost. Um, so that'd be really interesting to hear some people's thoughts who'd never played Animal Crossing. Because I think with New Leaf, because the 3DS was so, um, was so good, whoops, my bad. Um, I think a lot of people were introduced to Animal Crossing with New Leaf, but the Switch has been successful in sort of this, a very similar way, but <clears throat> even more so introducing people who don't console game into console gaming. And handheld and console are so different, um, and the Switch is both, so it's, it's such a unique experience as well. I mean, the Switch is literally the perfect thing for Animal Crossing because that was the downside about the Wii version. Um, because, oh, can't speak and concentrate. 
I think the downside with the Wii version is because you had to play it on the television, you just couldn't, you know, get into it as much. And certainly, like, the age I was when it came out, you know, I was living at home with my parents and I'd have to ask for the TV all the time and they didn't really understand. I was like, it's like a real time thing. You know, it's like, I have to play it at this time on this day. And they were just like, what are you talking about? <laughs> so Switch is like the perfect vessel for Animal Crossing. Ugh. I did a die. Octo Splash just did a little, a little sea bag to me. Very rude. Oh no, I think we're okay. Hopefully. Ooh, this could be a close one. Let me see. Um, it, I'm so bad at telling. Oh, so close. Very close. That's okay. I think I go down... Do I go down one point at this level? I'm not sure. The flags? It's either 0.5 or 1. I think it's 1 though. That is not on Paris. That's, that's not... That's not bomb... It's not bomb throw up. It's a sub power up. Okay, I'm at 7. So now I need to win 3 matches in a row. It's okay, we'll get there. Really, I just want to level up my gear. That's kind of my goal at the minute. Orange flags is just a bonus because I don't have that many left. Um, I think I need to do most of the chargers, but I think I've got one splatling gun as well, and then I'm pretty much done. So we're good. Did I just quit out or did I press yes? <laughs> I think I might have just quit out. I just totally zoned out and everything. Have you considered Okami on Switch? I have it, and I've played the first, uh, like, I think I've put like five hours into it. Um, so I reached Taka Pass, I think, was where I got to. Yeah, I did quit out. I'm so dumb. <laughs> oh, you guys, I'm the worst. I'm sorry. <laughs> Is because like I usually quit out so I don't play with the same people over and over so it's like this reflex I will not quit out next time I'm so sorry <laughs> I'm dumb um, yeah I do have Okami on switch and I bought the Japanese physical version and I actually saw <laughs> Dan you were playing Okami and I looked at it because I saw it pop up and I was like what the heck is that icon and I realized, oh, it's the English icon because I have the Japanese icon. And it just like, it confused me so much. My brain was like, huh? You know, like it just didn't compute. And I was like, that's Okami, but it's not Okami, but it was Okami. So yeah, that was funny earlier today. I've played, um, I've beaten Okami on Wii. And I actually own it on PlayStation 2 as well. Ugh. Baller. Jeez Louise, it's busy over here. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I beat it on Wii um, twice, I think. Um, I love it on Switch, using the Joy-Con. My most favorite thing about Okami on Switch is um, when you run, you can feel Amaterasu's... Um, paws like running you can feel the beat of her paws I think just like that's so cool it just makes you feel so like much more part of the game I'm running away I'm very aware that I'm being followed <laughs> oh no I think they gave up excellent <laughs> that's my party trick I show up cause havoc oh god oh help oh thank you my teammates saved me there, I think. Yeah, it's my party trick. I rock up and I run away real fast. He's my special here. Jeez. I also sneak up on people. I think I have I have a clip um, from a while ago when I was using an octobrush, and I just um, I was just running around the map like this. And I just snuck up on every one of their teammates one by one, ran behind them, <laughs> and killed them all. 
in like the one 30 second click. It was pretty great. Dang it. I died to the curling bomb. I feel like dying to the curling bomb feels pretty bad. Here, let me um ink this stuff. You know what I need to do? I need to use my stupid sprinkler more because I'm not using it and I, I really should be. I keep forgetting it's part of my utility. Oh man, I can't beat this. Oh, you, you waste your special. That's great. Oh crap. There's someone else here. Oh, I got him a couple times. Are you still here? Ugh. Death from above. Yeah, the ink brush is very easy to underestimate and you definitely want to take advantage of people who think that they can just flatten you because it's an ink brush. But honestly, the range is very good, so... Also, I forgot my death count is going to be really high because I've got uh, ink armor as my special. So that makes sense. Alright, this was good. I will continue this time. I'm so sorry, I'm done. Please, no judge. Please. Oh man, look at how cool that squid looks. Dang. Alright, I'm pressing A. Here I go. I No, I'm not. I'm gonna press up and A so I can change gear and continue. Dang it, I want that double fire fin so bad. I want it so bad. Okay, I need to do this quickly. Hold on. Eh. Eh. Um. Uh. Uh. This is the thing, and, um, d uh, um, <laughs> oh, this one, and this is fine. Okay. God, it's, the pressure is so high. <laughs> oh, man. If we get in, it'll be the first turf war. It's not a splat fest. Oh, nice. You're in. You've done it. Man, you're level 89. 35 star? Dang. This is some crazy spleen we're gonna have then. I hope we're on the same team. <laughs> Just got into Ryoshima Kos no Kami. Best music in the game? Oh. Yeah. I think so. Ryoshima Coast is... It's sort of... It's the second wind, right? So like you get through Okami, you do like the first arc, and then when you get to Ryoshima Coast, it's like Uh huh. Why did everyone drop out? <laughs> Hello? Okay, you're coming back. Um yeah, Ryoshima Coast is like this amazing second wind and you're kinda like, oh my gosh, this game is so much more. Um it kicked you out. No. Please come back. Oh no, you're back. We're fine. Man, what the heck is with this? Okay, we're all back. Perfect. <laughs> That's really weird. Man, I love this username. Full stop plus. What are those brackets called with the squiggly? Squiggly bracket. <laughs> Squiggly bracket and ampersand asterisk tall tall divider thing don't know what that's called close square bracket uh sorry open square bracket close bracket open square bracket perfect nailed it <laughs> first time oh man just got into the part in Okami where Ami gets shrunk. Oh man, that was a fun part. Almost the perfect team. Soon. Soon. It will happen. Hopefully. Right. Let me actually throw some um, inky stuff out. Some sprinklers. Death by sprinkler still gotta be one of the, <laughs> the worst ways to go. For sure. Oh god, there's many squids. I'm just gonna make a snappy exit and then try and sneak back in. Oh! They got splat bombed, but they fell off the stage, I think? That's okay. 
I'm gonna go and try and do some sneaky sprinklers on their side of the divide. Because you can throw them pretty far without actually getting into their divide. Their half. I'm just gonna waste some time up here, get my special back. I'll give my two teammates a little bit of time here. <sighs> Dang it. <laughs> oh, he's so close to dying, like he's got pink all over his face. Not quite though. I'm used to playing with the um, jet squelcher. And one of my favorite things to do with the jet squelcher is take down uh, people who are flying like that because they think that they're invincible. Speaking of jet squelcher, Zelda fan knows what's up. Holy crap. It's actually my favorite weapon. Um, and it's the weapon I used in all types of ranked mode. And I also got to rank X and everything, finally. Because I didn't get clam blitz for the longest time. Not because I couldn't climb, but just because I couldn't be bothered to commit <laughs> to doing so many battles. Um, but yeah, jet squelcher I use for every ranked mode and I love it. I think it's great. And I use the one that has um, the toxic mist and, uh, oh, dang it, kind of asked for that there. Toxic mist and the tent missiles, that's the one I like. See, I'm an ink brush and, and that's like, this is a bad weapon for me, so. I think I'm just gonna like peace out actually and try see if I can help my teammates on this side. Oh dang it, I'm sorry. They fell off the stage. I did try to get them for you. Um this ain't looking great. Let me just see if I can just go mad with colouring in. In the last five seconds, hope I don't run into anyone. Refill my ink with my special. I have no idea if we've won this or not. <laughs> I'm so bad at telling. Just. That was real close. We were in danger in the last like 30 seconds there. Nice flippers. <laughs> I love the flippers. They're great. Okay, I'm gonna press continue. For sure. Man, my squid looks unintentionally pretty dang cool. I really like the anarchy top actually. It's one of my favourites. That was real close, yeah. Oh my gosh. So if I win this next match, I'll get the orange flag. Do not throw. <laughs> if you're thinking about throwing, do not. There's no point. But it'd be cool if I won. Then I can switch to... I think I need to do the the splat thing that looks like a pen. I forget what it's called. Is it like the ballpoint something or other? I need to um, get that still. And I'm really bad with it. I, I don't understand how people use it because it's the one that starts off close range and then extends further out. I can't use it. I'm really bad with it. Oh, Zelda fan. Go up you on our team! <laughs> Come on! We still need the perfect team combo. Man, they changed this stage a little bit, didn't they? See, I went through a period where I didn't play Splatoon for a few months, and then when I came back, there were, you know, stage changes, and it I was just so confused because I didn't really look at any of the um, patches or anything. But um, yeah, there was like lots of changes being made some stages. This one's pretty minor, it's it's basically just the starting area, um, but some of them are, are really crazy. No! Oh my god, <laughs> so close to death. Wasted their special on me though, that's fine. I love being a nuisance. Also sprinkler on top of the tree is my favourite thing to do. <laughs> oh dang it, you got me! Oof. <laughs> Oh hey bud. <laughs> Both dead, huh? It happens. This there's this blaster down here and they're really annoying. I need to sneak out of the start zone because I am not getting anywhere. Run! Run 
run, run as fast as you can. I don't actually know where I'm going. Let's just go over here to be annoying. <laughs> Get on this side with the car. I love the car. It's such a weird thing because it's, you know, it's a human object. Like, why is the car here? It's fun. Not again! Oh, dang it! Blasters, man. Well, at least I coloured in a little bit. <laughs> Whoops. Oh man, now they're on our side. You're doing what I was doing. That's not fair. <laughs> How dare you? Alright, let's get some ink armor going. Just ran straight into the blaster. I thought my ink armor would protect me more, okay? It just didn't last as long as I thought. Dang it. <laughs> Alright. Let's try and color in. Oh no, the blaster. This is so bad. Dang it. Oh god. Run! <laughs> I'm so scared right now. Don't hurt me. Oh. I think I had everyone chasing me then. I, oh. I have not done anything this game. Holy crap. Alright, just throw one of those out. Try my best to just a little bit more colouring. I'm pretty sure... Dang it. I'm pretty sure we lost that one. That's okay. Look at those two with their long range weapons. Here I am with my brush. Like, what can I- look at all my little trails, though. I made my mark. I made my mark on this match. <laughs> oh. I didn't get any kills. Feels bad, man. Feels real bad. Okay, continue. Oh no, wait. Oh no, I don't need to change my shirt. We're fine. Anarchy? Dang it. I'm just trying to get doubles, you know, from abilities and stuff. <laughs> Uh, we'll see how it goes. Hello, Twilight Forest Keys. Welcome. Okay, I'm now two wins away. So, if I can get orange flag, that's really good. What I was trying to do recently was get gold flag, which is getting your freshness rating up to 50, and it is awful. I hate it. Because the problem is that I'd say Splatoon is a game that you can carry in. However, when you get party squids or when you get just lesser skilled players, it makes it really difficult. So the highest I got was 36.5 freshness. And then I lost so many consecutive battles that I went down to like 12. So I am just really demotivated now um but i would love to get a gold flag i think that would be amazing all right change changing things up here a little bit um we've still not got the perfect team <laughs> i hope it happens that would be good let me um ink up the car here get some ink armor so they've got what have they got oh the I actually ran under that hammer and my ink armor saved me. <laughs> that was so clumsy. Oh my gosh. Oh. He ended up throwing his hammer, which is absolutely the right thing to do. Um, a lot of people either just don't throw the hammer or they forget to throw it at the end. Oh! I got snipped. They did a, they did a good snipe. But I personally, sometimes I'll use the hammer just to throw it, because sometimes it's worth it. If you've got someone at a really awkward place, um, you can just take them out with the hammer and it feels really satisfying. Dang it! <laughs> I got sniped again! I need to be sneakier, I think. This is the problem. We're going full sneak mode. Here we go. And how's their ink over here? Let me throw one of these bad boys out. Try and get around behind some of these people. Oh, I saw that. I felt that whoosh past my head. <laughs> oh no. 
Here, look, I'm gonna, eh. I'm gonna put that right on top of the car. See if anyone's following me. I don't think so. I think it's coming though. I can feel it. Oh! Dang it! I didn't think they'd waste a special on me. That's crazy. Well, keep her going. Um, let's see. Where is everyone? Still on the bridge. Okay. Oh, I'm being chased by a. Dang it! <laughs> a slosher. It's so difficult. <laughs> Got all these long-range weapons. I haven't even seen the Splooshomatic player. Like, honestly, I, I just haven't seen them. Oh, now I'm stuck up here with a slosher and everything. I see you there. Right. We're going round. No. <laughs> no. No! <laughs> oh god, you could go fast too! Oh no. <laughs> Don't hurt me, please. <laughs> There we go. Some ink armor going. Grrr! Oh, what the heck? Okay, I got one kill. <laughs> I was so close to getting that slaughter flare, and then <laughs> they bollard and everything. Oof. I think that's a loss. Yeah. It's okay. Three wins, though. <laughs> this is why climbing and getting the flag is so hard, because like, you just- you just can't win every game. It's as simple as that. You just can't. No matter how hard you try, or, you know, if you pick a weapon that's really good at carrying, you just can't always win. I almost quit out there. Did you see that? <laughs> I'm so bad. You got close to gold with this flyer shot junior. See now, that's interesting because I actually made a new account to see if it would match me with lower level players. And it turns out it doesn't. I think there's just not a big enough um, player base. So I I get matched with like level 10 players even though I'm 40 star. Um, and I'd say the game's pretty good about doing even sides. But the problem is like you don't know if someone's smurfing. So, so like me making my smurf account just to see if it would help and discovering it didn't help was kind of interesting. But I think I could probably do it with the Splattershot Junior. I think that would be a good one to try it with. All right, we're half and half here. Let's see how this goes. Oh yeah. Throw one of these out. Look at that. Look at that placement. <laughs> Upside down sprinklers. The, um, I forget the name of it now, Ugh. the basketball stage, um, map. Oh, dang it. I always try and kill the hammer and it never works. <laughs> um, the basketball stage, you can place a sprinkler in the ceiling in the middle of the stage and it's so hard to get. It's so hard to take away, um, if you're not equipped with it for your weapon. Here comes another hammer. Ooh, they threw it real good. Man, this is tricky, huh? Having to fight to get out of her spawn. There we go. Repair some of this color damage. I hear another one. Jeez, how many hammer specials ugh, do we have on this stage? Man, don't... Don't try! Why would you try? <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, we're trying a different tactic. We're <laughs> gonna go this way. Throw one of these out and just take the safe, the safe coloring option. Get my special up, hopefully help my teammates. Here it goes. One is dead, but I feel like I just need to use it. I don't think anyone's around me. Ooh. Yeah, I can do Splushomatic. That is someone I can take out. <laughs> Small range friend. Oh no, it's a superior brush. Oh, Dan, I'm so sorry. <laughs> he 
He <laughs> pulled it out straight away with the hammer. Oof. Alright. Someone's bothering. I'm gonna follow. Oh no, they put the wall up. Dang it. You got me. I have my special as well, dang it. Mm, we need to do some repairing here, so let me throw that. Oh god, I'm scared. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> this is not looking good for me! Oh, <laughs> dang it. <laughs> Fair trade. A nice full swim speed up um, splat tea. I don't think I've actually done anything with my splat tea. Um, I think it's just completely blank. Oh, we're... Ugh. Oh. <laughs> oh man, we all died at the end there. I think that's probably a loss. <laughs> man, that was really tough. Getting cornered at the bottom of the stage like that, not the best. I feel like I should be using a weapon that I'm good at just to like redeem myself a bit more. <laughs> but those orange flags, man, they're so tempting. Let me just check what I need. Because, I mean, I like ink brushes enough. So, I think I have all the rollers orange. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure all the mains are orange. Okay, blasters I haven't done. <laughs> I'm so bad with blasters. Except the rapid ones. I can do those. Um, yeah, and chargers. Ugh, god, the 10987 is so stressful. I mean, I guess I'm ready. Like, I'll just play Ink Rush again, but... Dang. I think, like, Blasters and me just, just don't go well. <laughs> you know? Like, it's... it's difficult. And, like, Blasters are really good. Like, if you're good with them, you can just destroy. But it's just not something that my brain computes well with. <laughs> You're trying to push yourself with the charger? Yeah. I mean, you definitely want to get good with lots of different kinds of weapons. And I definitely use chargers all the time in the original Splatoon, but just not so much in this game. So I do definitely want to try and... Um, regain my skill with chargers because I don't think it's necessarily gone anywhere it's just that chargers just aren't um oh, dang it I should have killed him um chargers just don't seem as good in this game they got buffed and I think that their buff you know being able to hold charge while you're swimming is fantastic but it just doesn't feel like there is necessary like i'd say in ranked like you always had charger like there was always a player with a charger and now i don't feel like i see that as much for whatever reason get him <laughs> yay <laughs> that was real close i don't think they knew i was there because of um they didn't like turn around or anything gonna throw some annoying sprinklers. <laughs> it's actually a pretty good tactic is to throw a sprinkler behind someone because then it distracts them and then you can potentially go in for the splat. Sometimes, not all the time. Yay, there we go. Man, I love the rapid blaster. Me saying I'm not good with blasters is the only blaster I can use. Ugh, dang it. Got straight through my ink armor. Watch out, there's someone coming down. Ah. Right, I'm gonna have to go get revenge now, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, let's see. Anyone down here? Yes? No? <laughs> Where'd they go? See, if I can sneak up on them, I can get them, but... Ah! 
Got him. Oh, I knew they were there. I knew they were there. Dang it. That was stupid. Careful, there's someone right here. I'm curious, how many people who play Splatoon use ouch? Because it, I think it, ouch either goes one of two ways. Either you're like, ouch you idiot, how didn't you save me? Or like, why didn't you kill them? You know, it's like a an anger thing or like, oh it's so unfair that I died or you know, etc. Um, or you can use it in a helpful manner where you can be like, oh I died, be careful, there's still a squid there, right? Don't die right at the end. <laughs> uh, I might have died right at the end. Nobody saw that, right? Oh no, my death might have actually mattered. 2%? That could have mattered. Feels bad, man. <laughs> Aww. Okay, I need to change gear. So let me, I don't know if I have any headgear, but if not, that's okay. I think, like if I'm gonna drop out of a match, I'll say beforehand. Um, that, I think I'm waiting on something. Do I have anything that just needs to be like topped up? I mean, I guess I'll wear these. These are really strange because I don't have the squid force. It's giving me like fire fin stuff, but we'll go with it. Use ouch to warn teammates. Yeah, I, I try and do so, but I feel like I never really see ouches unless it's they've died and like the game's about to end. That annoys me because there is nothing, there's no reason to ouch at that point. Or it'll be someone who's like halfway across the map and they're saying ouch and I'm like, what do you want me to do about it? <laughs> like, I can't help you. I don't know, it's, it's a weird one. I was playing ranked um, and I did a, I did a this way because it was, oh, dang it. <laughs> I did a this way um, because it was clam blitz and I had nine clams and I was, you know, it had highlighted me as the person who has um, the most clams on my team so everyone could see that and I'd managed to position myself right at the enemy's basket and I was hiding. So I was saying this way so that someone could super jump to me and um, you know, throw me a clam and then we'd get a dunk. That was the, the hope. Um, so I use it, I use this way like that. I feel like nobody ever listens. Um, it, it's really frustrating because often I'll use it when it's a case of a lot of people have died, like maybe two of my teammates have died and I'll retreat somewhere safe and I'll say this way so that they know that they can super jump to me. But I feel like it just never happens. Like, maybe it's just me, I don't know. But like, oh, that's so bad. <laughs> oh no. Um, like I try and communicate as much as possible, but it, it just seems really pointless sometimes, which sucks. But like doing the clam blitz thing, like the way that you should play clam blitz is you should never um, get a ball and then just start going towards your enemy's basket. Like you have to do it sneakily. You have to throw clams to other players, which I assume like, I, I feel like everyone forgets that they can throw clams to other players. So I'll have like seven and someone will have five and I'm like wanting them to combine with me and they just don't do it. So I end up throwing my clams to them even though I have more and then they just sort of will either make the dunk or not but I don't know it just feels like communication should be better. I don't know why the um, left and right keys aren't used. I feel like the left and right keys should be used for something. Um, 
I've always said that they should one should be attack and one should be defend. So like, if you're in the lead of a, a ranked match or even turf war, I guess, um, you should be able to say like, attack, like let's push or defend, like just don't die, protect um, and so on. I feel like it doesn't make sense that those buttons aren't utilized because you have up and down and that's it. So I feel like there could be improvements made to make communication a little bit easier. Dang it, <laughs> I'm on a losing streak now. Um, I'm not sure what I could be doing better. I feel like I'm doing good with ink coverage. I probably need to just get more kills, but I find it quite hard to be aggressive as an ink rush. So we'll see if I can maybe be more aggressive or I can try and sneak into behind enemy lines and get some sweet super jumps to me. I'm not even green anymore, it's dry. Oh, the worst. So dry. Roller got a lag splat at the end. Oh, no. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I experienced a tiny bit of lag. I'm not sure why that happens. We're full, but it says waiting on- oh there we go. <laughs> I think everyone was just having to like, get synced up. It's like when you start a game and it's turf war and it does the opening cinematic and then the cinematic plays again and you're like, who's got that internet? Who is it? <laughs> but we're fine here. Alrighty. Let's go. I'm gonna do my old sprinkler on top of the car trick because I just think that that's funny. <laughs> Man, this music slaps. Oh no. Bad time, bad time, tension missiles. What happened over here? Bad things happened over here. Um, gosh, this flings a roller has really got it in for me. Oh, they jumped off the bridge, dang it. I would have had them otherwise. Alright, let's see what's going on over here. I actually, usually I like to have ninja squid when I'm a brush, just so that I can be completely, like, sneak mode. Um, oh! I was- I thought there was one squid and there were two squids. Um, it happens, I guess. Let me throw that down there. Okay, we're activating sneak mode. Let's do a- a big sneak. Big sneak incoming. <laughs> Hopefully. Alright, everyone's dead. Okay. I'm gonna do a this way to try and get people to- Oh, I need to protect my friends! Okay, I protected my friends. If I died there, that would have been so embarrassing. <laughs> Can you imagine? Oh god, I would have just caused, like, team death. Gotta run. Oh no, I might think, shoot! <laughs> my plan! Oh no! It's okay. Hello? Oh nice. Let me just... Oh man, that flings a roller is really good. <laughs> I need to peace out real fast. Man, there's just purple everywhere. What is going on? Alright, ink armor, go. Ah! Oh my god, that pushed me so far back. Oh, bad. Oh, dang it. <laughs> <laughs> There's not much you can do about a splashdown. If you're stuck, you're it's a tough one. Alright, we're in danger. It's not looking good. Let me just run around for the last 12 seconds and try and not die. Eight. <laughs> They're chasing me. Six. Five. Ah, oh, dang it. <laughs> 
Yeah, I think um, the short range of the brush is just not my friend today. <laughs> Maybe I'll switch to my my true calling. Maybe I should jet squelcher. Like I'm getting high enough scores. I think it's just like one of those things. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna change weapon. Screw the orange flags. I want to feel good about myself. <laughs> Let's change to the Jet Squelcher. Ah, uh, favorites. Here we go. Very recently got um, the Silver Turf Medal, which feels pretty good. But yeah, Jet Squelcher for life. It's my absolute favorite weapon. 14.5. Oh, I was up at the dizzying heights of 36.5. And when you're up that high, if you lose, you're minus three, so it's real bad. Like, it feels so bad to lose. So for every one match you lose, you have to win three to even out. So you have to win at uh, 80% of your games if you want to climb. It's really tough. But I, I do love this weapon, so let's give it a go. Man, it's the crazy song. I don't dislike this song, but it's not one of my favorites, is how I'll put it. Yeah. Yeah, you think you're safe up there, but I have a jet squelcher, so watch out. Oh. Usually I like to try and kill these guys. I got a couple hits on him, but not enough. Oh, they super jumped away. Did you see that? It's actually quite rare. Oh! Ow! <laughs> it wasn't even the hammer! It was a snipe! The heck, man? <laughs> that was nasty. I suppose it's my job to get rid of chargers now, isn't it? Let me just get some sweet inkage here. Alright, let's get them all while they're at spawn. Slow him down. Got one of them. It does feel pretty good to get people with tenta missiles. It's not super common. The reason I actually really like um, tenta missiles is because it gives me the position of everyone on the map. So I can scroll around and figure out where everyone is even before I fire them, right? Man, everyone's like hiding up there. Here, let me do one of these. <laughs> this is great. Oh, this feels bad though. Oh man, I'm concentrating. <laughs> you know I'm concentrating when I stop talking about something. Yeah, nice job. We're like all grouped up here just causing absolute havoc. Man, I don't think it's safe to be over here though. How are we doing for ink? Uh, we could do with a little bit of um, ink up here. Oh my gosh, that was scary. Man, that was nuts. Uh oh, I'm blooded. I should not have fired that when I had a line of sight of a charger, but hey ho. It worked out okay. Ah, oh, big, big ouch. I keep dying at the end of battle. I feel like this is a big problem. Here, let me just like get some sneaky inks. I have no idea if we won that match or not. I think we did. Hey. Told you, <laughs> it was the ink brush the whole time. Definitely. <laughs> Sweet. You'd like to play, you don't think your connection is stable enough? Aw, green rupee. I mean, you can try. Like, it's, um, it's no bother. Um, let me know if you want to and I can add you on the switch. The switcheroo. Like Jet Squelcher 2, just not good against long-range weapons with more 
KO power. Yeah, I think um, if you if you're matched up against a oh, not a splatter a splatter shop pro with lots of um, the ability that increases the range, it's so disappointing because you're like. I can beat you if I stay really far back, but then they have, you know, this upgraded weapon and you're like, dang it, that's what I should be doing. Um, but hey ho. You're gonna switch, but you're determined to do better. Oh man, maybe we should form a, a charger club and like only use chargers. I think chargers are pretty good in turf war for inking, which seems silly, but like if you just, stand in a line and do like this, like walk left, you can ink like just as fast as a lot of the main weapons. Like, it, it's surprisingly good. I think people don't do it very often. Let's see if I can trap this guy. Not quite, they got out. Yeah, that's another reason I love this weapon so much is I can combine um, the toxic mist with the special and it just wrecks because people, you wait for them to try and escape and then you toss the toxic mist and there's nothing they can do and it's hilarious, I love it. Obviously it benefits the main weapon too. Hey, good job up here, you're, you're doing work. Whoa, careful now. Got him. Let me retreat somewhere safer, I'll use my special down here. Um, oh gosh, they're all up there. Yeah, my favorite thing about Tent Missiles is being able to know where all of the bad guys are. Like, I think, um, people don't really use the echolocator thing much. Um, oh man, look at that splashdown. It's huge. Oh, sorry I couldn't save you. Rest in pieces. <laughs> Whoa, someone's coming up. Oh, I love the dynamo roller. Holy crap. <laughs> oh no, it's dead. Dynamo roller is sick. I love it. Like, I love it so much. I think um, it's potentially one of the best weapons in the game just because of its ability to kill and also ink. It, it's so bizarre. If used correctly, it's phenomenal. Um, you just gotta be really careful because you're so vulnerable when you're swinging. It takes such a long time to swing that you can get, you know, sniped or bombed. Like that's the worst feeling is when um, you're like mid throw. Oh no! You're mid throw and then um, someone tosses a splat bomb under you. Man, that sucks. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh my gosh, that was so close. <laughs> I'll save you. Crap, I didn't save you. That was my job. Oh, the sneaky little sploosh matic <laughs> Stop it. I'm out of it. Run. Bad. Oh god, Dan, why? <laughs> oh my god. How did you get behind me? That was crazy. I guess she just respawned and came down there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was a really intense match. Hey, Did a win. Good job. Look at these stupid glasses on my face. <laughs> I'll need one more battle for these shoes. Hopefully I'll get the double on Petty um, ability, which is sub powered up. Hey, I'm back in super fresh. <laughs> Maybe this is the start of the climb to the gold flag. Maybe that's what's gonna happen here. I doubt it, but <sighs> I will try again. I just feel like my ego is too bruised at the moment. Like I can't quite process it, but um, soon. Forgot Ninja Squid was a thing for a second. Aw. Ninja Squid's great. You gotta um, have a backup of swim speed. So you need to have 
um, I think it's three little swims to counteract the slowness that it gives you. But aside from that, it's, it's a real good one. Um, I think I have a I have a crack on clothing item. I think it's the bowling shirt that has like the glove and it has um, ninja squid and three swim speed up so it negates itself in the one item of clothing which is cool. I like things to be efficient like that. And we're still not all on the same team that's crazy. All right let's go again. See what everyone's doing. There's a blaster who's gonna just walk straight into my trap. Oh come on, one hit! Oh, they jumped off the stage. <laughs> Who was that? Was that one of us? I don't think that was one of us. <laughs> that was funny though. Oh man, let's just do some some inking up here. Charge my special in safety. Oh look, look at that range. I'm like just out of range. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Alright, let's see where we're at. Alright, let me get out of here. This is danger town. I think there's quite a few of them down here. Yep, yeah, there's one. <laughs> I tossed a really late toxic mist. I tried to help. I really tried. All right, I seem to be doing fine. Do some sneaking. Oh no, I see you up there. I'm not risking that. I'm gonna just stay right where I am. Thank you very much. See if any, oh no, you've had a, a lever. Dang it. Oh, it's that blaster that dropped off the stage. Oh, I'm sorry. That kind of sucks. I mean, I guess it's very much likely to be a win for me, which is great, but it feels bad under these circumstances. The good thing is that you don't actually lose your freshness rating if someone's dropped out early enough in the match. I think it's as long as it's sort of a minute since, um, a minute from the end of the match. Um, I think it counts it as somebody's left, which is good. Um, something that was actually really unfortunate, um, during my placement matches for ranked, I actually, um, I actually ended up getting into a lot of matches that had levers in them. And although it wouldn't have, you know, usually if I hadn't, if I'd placed, it would be like, Oh, um, some players disconnected early on, so this will be a, a draw. Um, but instead, it still counted as one of my 10 placement matches, which just basically wasted my placement. So I could have got a much better placement had obviously those been wins or whatever. But um, more just from the point of view that it was a waste was like really annoying. So I actually didn't place very well at all in a lot of my rank X matches, um, especially clan blitz. I, I ended up um, winning five and losing five. And I think three of those five losses were because of levers. So that felt kind of bad. That didn't feel great. Yeah, that squid who jumped off the stage just, just left. <laughs> okay, I need to change my shoes. Um, so let me change my- oh, Dang it, it didn't get the double! Come on. Okay, after... After this match, I'm gonna drop out and I'm gonna scrub some of my gear. Just so you guys are aware. So I'm continuing, but after this next one, we'll drop out. Hey Crazy Corn, how are you doing? Welcome. You were the sniper, yeah. That's funny. It's it's really good when you're a very aware of a weapon's range and you can just stay barely outside of it and you can um, just annoy the sniper so much because you're like, I know exactly what you can do and you can't get me. <laughs> but um, man, I guess like, 
scopes, you might not be able to tell whether or not there's a scope on a weapon. I personally don't use scope chargers, I think that they're kind of dumb, with the exception of the E-Liter potentially, um, but I don't, I don't like the scope chargers personally. Yeah, I'm good thanks, friend. Um, I'm doing pretty well. And we're split again, this is crazy. <laughs> it's not happening. All right, we'll have a little breather after this match. I will um, see about scrubbing some gear because I have a decent amount of money now. And then, oh, look at that, juicy. All four of them. Oh God. Let me try and avenge you here. Nah, not quite. Man, there's a lot of rain coming this way. I feel like they must have a special power up. Another hammer? Oh my gosh, nice. Dude, you just sniped the hammer. Ugh. I couldn't avenge you. No! Dang it! <laughs> I tried to avenge you. Almost. Man, I feel like, um... Eh. Ooh, that was a big ouch. I didn't even see that splat bomb. The heck? All right, let's try again. Man, there's that hammer every time. You try and do some cleanup here. This isn't the thing about our team composition at the moment. There's not much ink coverage happening. So I think I'm actually the best one equipped for this kind of thing. Nice job. I think um, what I like about the jet squelcher- dang it you sneaky bugger. <laughs> It's hilarious. Just boom, boom. Nice Excal, man. It's like my ultimate rival as a Jet Squelcher user because it's so much more powerful and basically the same range. But I just like being able to like do the five little shots that takes five to kill with this weapon. So it's like do, 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 do. and I like that. I feel like it's really satisfying. But yeah, against the, the gal it's tough. Man, this, those Julies are also a bit of a nemesis of mine. Oh my god! <laughs> I didn't- the hammer wasn't on my radar at all. Um, yeah, the, the long range Julies are really tough for me because I have to constantly like adjust my aim, which isn't great. Yeah, I think we've just fallen short a bit with um, ink coverage on this one, which is probably my fault. I think I was the one that was supposed to be doing that but didn't catch on until it was too late. That's okay though. We can get through it. <laughs> okay, we're dropping out now. <laughs> I just have to tell myself that. I have to tell myself each time. Jess Culture's four kits? Oh dang it, my bad. I think I've had um, instances where it sounds like five and that's why I think that. Here, let me go and look at the the thing. Or like, I think it, what it is is I hear five then, maybe. Maybe I'm just dumb. Yeah, it's four. But like, I think, see how that was 122 and that's 128? Why was that? That was 112. See, that was five. So it can be five, but I guess it just depends. So that's interesting, because I don't know. I guess that's doing damage without being a direct hit, right? I can't get it to work now. Hello? Game. <laughs> Front out of ink. Um, 
I'm trying to work out how I did that. It's like, it's doing that, see like if you hover above their head, it doesn't make contact but it still damages. That's interesting. So it can be five if you're not direct hits. <laughs> but yeah, if you're in someone's face, it's like one, two, three, four. I, I really like this weapon though. Like look at this ink coverage, man. You can just walk to the side. Oh my gosh, so many targets. <laughs> All right, um, I want to say that I'm done and I want to check out my gears. So I'm trying real hard at the moment to get the double fire fin on this and it ain't happening. This is like the sixth time I'm going to have to scrub it and I haven't gotten double fire fin yet. <laughs> it's really frustrating. Um, I just really want to get, I want to get the triple and I'm happy to use chunks, ability chunks, but I really just want to get the double so that I can save a little bit. I don't have that many chunks um, in sub saver though. So yeah, it's, it's a bit of a, a tight squeeze. You can tell which abilities I don't really use. <laughs> Poor bomb defense up. It, it got like the buff and everything, but dang it, I just, I don't feel like it's necessary at all. <laughs> hey, Blue Zombie Boy, welcome. Stages change at six. Yeah, they do. So we're still gonna be um, the same stuff here. Let me see. I wanna scrub a dub dub, and I wanna scrub this. Because I really want the double fire fin. So bad. Um. These shoes, I'm not that bothered about these, but I feel like it's quite a good pair to have just because sub power up um, and, and sub ink saver go really well together. And then headgear, um, headgear is probably the one that I'm most set on. I guess the Anarchy Beret would be quite good. Um, <laughs> What do I need? I guess we'll just go with the beret for now. I'll have to actually look at this more in depth. I, I've written down on a piece of paper like all the ability combinations and what I need. Um, but I don't have that piece of paper to hand right now. So um, that's everything. Thank you. Actually, wait, I think I ordered something. Let me check. Um. I think I've got double on this. Yeah, it's not worth it. See ya. Let me see if, if any of you have good gear for me real quick. Oh man. Some, some nice gears. That I don't need, but I appreciate how perfect those gears are. That makes me happy. Oh, let me see who's out here. This is a fantastic outfit. Very cute octoling. Um, I'm good. All right, let me just equip some stuff and then we'll go. If I use bomb defense up, it's either one or three subs or a bunch of it. Yeah, like it definitely has uses. I just don't feel like it's, um, it makes an impact on how I play. Um, but yeah, like if, if you're the kind of person who's very aggressive in their play style, um, for sure it makes a lot of sense. <laughs> look at this, look at this beret glasses. Man, what a cool squid. <laughs> um, yeah, let's go with this. Do I want to try a different weapon? Maybe I should go like charger and feel really bad. <laughs> I think there's actually some Julies that I haven't. Yeah, the clear dapple Julies. Are these? Yeah, these are like short range. And I don't. Oh, I've still got to do some of the brellas. Tenderbrellas are tough to use. Like, really tough to use, I feel like. I mean, at least everything has a green flag, right? Here, let me. 
You know what? I'm going to go back to this ink brush, the permanent ink brush. We're going to try that again. Because I, I think ink brushes are fun. I don't feel like I have a huge amount of impact on games, but I think it's fun. So we'll see. We're going to switch to the Splattershot Junior for funsies. Man, it's a great weapon, isn't it? I mean, it, it really is. Very fun. I'm glad that they made two other versions of it as well. It got it got some love. That makes me happy. Alright. I'm in. So I'll press continue. And then oh man, my shoulders just cracked. <laughs> I'll press continue and then we can um hopefully get you lot back in and we'll play some matches. And everything will be a-okay. So you can like critique my gameplay if you're not playing <laughs> kindly. Please do it kindly. <laughs> I mean again I don't use many brushes but um, it seems fun to use brushes. Um, I just feel like they're fairly situational. Oh man did you see that? They had um Oh, what's that ability called? The one that where you roll after a super jump that I've never used ever, even though I think it's really cool. Man, that is the slowest tent missiles ever. I was waiting there for ages. Oh man, there's there's many squids up here. Oh god, they've got ink armor. <laughs> Dang it. I might have been able to get that if they um didn't have ink armor. Oof. All right, let's do some uh, good placements for my sprinkler. Cover up that. You can like put it to this up on the ceiling here, right? Put. There we go. Nope. How dare you? Oh. Please don't critique that. That was just bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my sprinkler will have died in that as well. Here, let me go put oh, these tent missiles. Like every time, like there must be more than one person who has that. Eh. Oh, what the heck? It went sideways. Eh. There we go. Right. I really should have got that kill. I'm. I'm mad at myself. Good job, roller friend. Here, I'll ink armor. We'll get them together. Yay, nice. <laughs> Teamwork makes the dream work. I'm gonna be an annoying little squid at spawn. Hee hee hee. Look at me messing up all this hard work that you did. Hee hee hee. I think my sprinkler's dead. Throw another one of those. Ooh, hello. Okay. At least I traded. That was okay. How are we doing? Oh, everyone's dead. That's not good. Um, let me just plonk one of these down and try and do some repairs here. Someone's coming after me. Oh gosh, it's a tri slosher. That is so bad. <laughs> oh, can't even get them with ink armor. There we go. No. <laughs> Please don't critique that match. <laughs> it wasn't very good. Uh, drop roller, that's the ability. I, I don't know the name of it because I, I've never used it, but I think it's cool and definitely throws people off. Um, it's a good one. All right, I'm gonna press continue and hopefully we'll have some space. And then we'll pretty much just be continuing through until um, six o'clock. We have a level six player, which is interesting. I wonder if they're a genuine new player or if it's a Smurf account. We'll see. Hey, we're all in. Good job. 
Like using a splash down to debate players on every jump. That is absolutely 100% the play. Super jumping um, splash downs is something I've never quite mastered, um, but when it happens, I have nothing but respect for the player that pulls it off. It, it's a good one. All right, we're gonna plop that on the car there. I took very careful aim, <laughs> unnecessarily careful aim at that car. All right. Man, this is my favorite color. I'm so happy. I'm so on brand today. I've got my, um, my turquoise teal jumper on. I'm so on brand. It wasn't even like intentional. <laughs> I just like the color, okay? I like teal and turquoise and whatever else you want to call it. Teal to me is like dark turquoise. That's how I would describe teal. Um, but it can be lots of things. Aqua, you could call it. I think I'd probably verge more on green than blue. I think in the blue-green mix, it'd be slightly more green. That's how I would describe my favorite color. Oh, I was trying to... Oh, there were more squids than I thought there were squids. <laughs> it's fine. I'll take care of this awkward little alleyway back here that's kind of odd. Doesn't really do much. Do the old sprinkler on top of the tree trick. One of my favorites. Whoa, I just... I got killed by someone else's tenta missiles. That's unfortunate. Which means my sprinkler's dead. Which means I'm gonna go put it back on top of the tree. Because I really like doing that it makes it awkward to get to but still offers a decent amount of um, coverage. There's a carbon roller going under the bridge, maybe I can head them off. Carbon roller, it's fine if they're downhill. Um, you can pretty much out splat them if it's downhill like that. So that worked out quite well. I really like this map on uh, splat zones. It's very fun. Because I think there's a, a real good opportunity to like sneak behind, but equally it's not, it doesn't feel unfair, you know? Man, this tri slaughter player is really good. I'm not sure if it's one of us or not. I'm not paying any attention. I'm gonna throw a sprinkler over there. Do some annoying ink coverage, you know? Aw, oh, dang it. I was trying to be a hero and I got splatted by the carbon. I think it was a, a combination of tenta missiles and the actual roller though. Three, two, one. I didn't kill the Julia wielder, but I did ink a lot of what they were trying to do. So I think we're good for this one. Yee. I think I'm down at like freshness four though. I have a little bit of a ways to go to get my orange flag with this weapon. Dang, I mean you can't really beat the ink coverage of the Splattershot Jr. I mean you can, but like, you you gotta respect it. Splushomatics I think are just better, but there is something nice about using the, the baby weapon, you know. I think it's fun. He kept being against all three. No. That was pretty fun. I think there were some good exchanges in that one. We're still to get everyone on the same team. That's all I want. That's all I want. Doo -ba -doo -ba -doo -boo. Got some high level players coming in here. So we'll see how it divides us all. All right, we in. See how it goes. Use the junior for the sub special combo. Yeah, it's it's really strong. Like you just charge it up so fast, and the bomb just helps. You know, deal with range. 
it's it's a it's a nice one for sure. All right, let's go over here. The old ceilings. Oh, why do I keep doing it sideways? Oh, can I please? There. Oh. I thought I was gonna come in and save the day, but nope, wasn't needed. <laughs> that was just fine. And the ink coverage with this brush is kind of insane. Like, it feels real good. Oh, I got one hit, but it wasn't enough. I wasn't sure how close to death they were. Not close enough, it turns out. He's still over here. Someone's over here. Oh gosh, look, we both have ink armor. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was like, why are they charging in when we obviously have ink armor? But um, yeah, we both did. Yeah. Good job. Clear off all this rain here. All right, let's go again. <laughs> Just throwing a really obnoxious sprinkler. <laughs> it's fun, like you can actually access quite a lot. Um... <laughs> Look at that, how annoying that is. <laughs> oh man, this tri slosher really has it in for me, I think. Not really sure what I can do here. Oh, straight to the face. Um, I was gonna sell super jump, but I don't think I need to. I think I'm more needed over here than anywhere else. Keep getting my sprinklers sideways. <laughs> Why'd this happen? Does it still work um, if you put a sprinkler on someone who's super jumping? Does it still do a crap ton of damage or is that kind of changed now? Because I feel like before a lot of the time people would um, put a sprinkler on someone, on the enemy who's super jumping and it would often cause them to just die because they got hit so many times. I don't know if that's still a thing or not. Or if you had to have sub power up or something for it to work. I'm sure there's something like in the back of my head that I remember that. But I'm not super de clear on the details. Oh, there's a Roxy in the chat. The best emote. <laughs> Roxy's face. <laughs> oh, she's asleep right now. I was, I wasn't sure if she was gonna wake up in time for the stream or not, but I think she might be asleep. So there may not be a Roxy today. We'll see. Farfed. No. Neither of those things are the things that are advertised. <laughs> Dang it, I just want some good gear, you know? That's all I want. When are you doing the Teach Nicola Discord stream? Oh, I should do it soon. I should do it before New Horizons comes out. Like, I've used Discord before, it was just a very long time ago and I don't know how to set up, like, my own thing. So we will have to do it. Um, I'm not sure when. Next week, probably? Um, because the plan at the moment is we're gonna have one more Animal Crossing stream on Sunday. And that's gonna be, like, wrapping up New Leaf. Um, but I do want to talk about New Horizons because I need some help deciding on my island name. I think it's probably more appropriate if we talk about that in the Animal Crossing stream. So yeah, I think like next week we'll kind of just do like a big preparation week where I just play like stuff but really it's mostly like chatting and um, kind of just preparing for the future, if that makes sense. Man, that, that sprinkler did not go where I wanted it to go, but hey-ho. Just causing trouble over here. 
Uh oh. Big tent missiles. There's only two of us alive, but I would rather- Oh my god, the force of that pushed me back so far. Chase me, chase me. <laughs> They're doing it. <laughs> oh, this is great. I just wanted to get them away from our base. <laughs> they actually chased me. No! I got- I got bombed. <laughs> Dang it. It's that OP weapon. The Splattershot Junior. Oh shoot. I'll read that in a second. Oh, you almost caused me to get bombed because I was looking at my laptop. <laughs> I'll read that in a second. Thank you whoever that was. Um, I'll be with you in a moment. <laughs> oh man, I'm scared. I'm very trapped and there's bombs everywhere. Feels like every weapon has splat bombs. Yeah, let me throw that up there. Uh oh. The battle of close range is commencing and I'm losing. <laughs> I see those splat bombs. I know how good they are and you're rolling them across the ground in a very professional way. <laughs> and I'm very scared of these bombs. Someone's behind me. Oh man, I feel very trapped right now. <laughs> Yay, Splushomatic, the one weapon that has the worse range than me. <laughs> oh man. I love the Splushomatic, so don't get me wrong, like, they're amazing. Yes, use your Booyah Bomb just on me. That is totally fine. I will happily be that distraction. Ah, got him! Man, that was close. <laughs> that was a real close one. Oh, I think I just threw my sprinkler in the water. That doesn't feel good, does it? <laughs> oh! I'm trying to get a final sprinkler in to cause some trouble. Hey, nice! Final ink armor. It doesn't look like we're gonna win this, but even so, I feel like I played pretty well there. Do 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 do. Right. Who was that? Who made that noise? Crazy Corin, you subscribed. Thank you for four months. Now you're going to be streaming again. May as well resub. Oh, thank you, friend. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. You have access to the best emote that is Roxy's face. <laughs> Enjoy! Oh man. Anarchy? No! It, no! I almost quit out. I didn't though. I'm getting better. <laughs> you guys had a dancer? Oh shoot, did we? I didn't even notice. Oh well. Party squids are allowed to exist. I just don't want them in my games. <laughs> like... I understand maybe if there's a lever really early on. Although 3v4 wins are definitely possible, I can understand having a party because there's been a lever or even two levers. I'm okay with that. People who literally do that the whole battle, I'm not okay with. And there's actually a fair amount of people who throw ranked matches in Splatoon, which is surprising to me because I feel like it's such a, a hard game to like match up with and everything. Um, but I've had too many people who are doing that um, in in ranked in rank X as well. So I guess they're just trying to like boost their friends or whatever. But man, it it really sucks because you know if there's a lever and it's early enough, you don't get the penalty of losing rank. Um, if someone's just messing around at spawn or whatever you don't like there's no way of the game knowing that they're throwing so you you just lose um you lose your rank and it it, it sucks <laughs> it just plain sucks yeah i get those ink armors going man do, 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 do. surprise <laughs> i think i might have actually died there if i I just got out surprised. 
feels bad, man. <laughs> um, yeah, I think I might have actually died there if I didn't have my ink armor, so it wasn't the best surprise. I just wanted to see how long I could follow behind them without them noticing, because <laughs> I think that's hilarious. It's one of my favorite things about the old ink brush. Nope. Ugh, dang it. I was being chased by the Hydra Splatling and then I kind of ran into a roller. Running into a roller is like never, never good. Never ever ever good. Alright, got someone coming over here. Oh, crap. Careful. Oof. Yep, they got us good. Let's regroup. Man, these pigeons on my map. Get out of here, pigeons. Let's try and do some safe inking from up here before I jump down. Yeah, I can see that there's someone here. I got a couple hits on them, but... Yeah, got him. Yes, waste your special. Waste it real good. <laughs> We're doing it. Teamed up with someone else. The ink brush is a great distraction for your friends to get kills. <laughs> I mean, it, that's pretty much like the unique selling point of the ink brush. Dang it, they got away. That's fine. I'll just clean up right behind them so all their efforts are going to waste. <laughs> Like, I'm literally just cleaning up the mess. <laughs> oh man. Good job. We did a win. We did one whole win. Hooray. Aw, <laughs> oh, the, the party squid inked like 500 but kept flopping around. Aw, oh, yeah, it's a shame. You'd think that, you know, if nobody was joining them that they would actually make an effort. But hey ho. Do do do. It's four times you've been against you three. Yeah, I think it's because you're a really high level. So I think you're like the um, opposite of me, potentially. Well, no, because we've got a 35 star. So surely, yeah. I'm not really sure how this pairing like is working. Because usually, I, I mean, it must try and balance out the eight players, right? By like averaging out their level or whatever. We gotta get four together. Please. <laughs> please, please, please. We have a few more. It does feel pretty random, but I, I like to hope that there is something in it, but jeez. Okay, well, at least it's 2v2 this time. This apple love person seems like a pretty good player. Yay, I didn't get the sideways sprinkler this time. <laughs> Hooray, maybe I should just see if I can leave it there all game. Whoop. Oh god, I've been accosted by splat bombs up here. Nope. <laughs> oh, rude. Oh, Ken's a sloshy machine. Dang. That'll do it. That'll do it for sure. Forget what the sub and stuff is for that weapon. Oh, I guess it being sideways doesn't really matter. Oh, bugger. <laughs> You're so close to death. Man, I have those same shoes as you. The max sub school shoes. I have those. Let me just do some cleanup at home base here. Make everything nice and yellow. This yellow color is like amazing. It's so rich. Like it's not, it's not fluorescent, which I like, but it's just so um, delicious looking. Like it's so, like rich is the only word I can think of. I should be more adequate with colors, but um,
Jeez, concentration mode, stop talking immediately. <laughs> Happens every time. Need to get better. Let's see if I can just, yeah. Just throw some cheeky sprinklers around. We've actually got a really interesting team composition. So we have two sort of mains and two rollers, quote. I am classed as a roller weapon, but they're very different. So I think it's cool. Doing well at holding the lead so far. Just try and... Whoa, <laughs> that was close. You did good, there was two of us there. Oh no! Hey, at least my team's there to uh, clean up my mess. <laughs> Just got sandwiched again. All right, two down, so there is potential to lose this in the last 20 seconds, so let me just try and do some safe inking. Seems good. All right. We did it. Woo. Vibrant. Yeah, that's a good word. But I th I, it's, it's not, um, it's not too pale or too sort of in your face like it's so it's just a yummy yellow <laughs> oh dear it's like yellow ochre sort of it's got that deepness to it man i study design i should be able to talk about colors more eloquently than i am <laughs> let's go again hey alexa uh, how how do you say your name is it alex or alexa Gaius? I can't read. Words are hard. <laughs> you can stay alive? Man, you were like dodging. I saw you. You were doing you were dipping in and out. Um it was funny. Alex, cool. Hello Alex. The painted game is very hard. <laughs> Coloring in. It's fun. Yeah, it's it's sort of um I think Again, Splatoon, you can definitely carry games, but you, you do need a good team to win. Um, I think in ranked, it's actually easier to carry, which is funny because you wouldn't think it would be. But um, I definitely found myself carrying ranked more. Oh hey, it's just me. I don't think it's actually been just me. So that's funny. Don't hurt me, guys. <laughs> Please. Nah, it's okay. I don't want any any pity or sympathy. Give it your your bestest shot. I mean, I have an ink brush and like everyone else has high range weapons, so I don't think I'll be um, entering combat unless I absolutely have to. <laughs> Someone's over here. Yeah, there you are. See that washing machine? I see it. Don't think I don't see it. No. Dang it. I tried to run away. I just quite didn't make it. Man, that is a cute oxaling. It's got like the the cool gear on and like the pin in the hair and everything. That is a cute oxaling. I'm a squid at the moment. You know, I really like the oxalings. I feel like they need more haircuts. The poor Oxaline girls, they only have two haircuts. And like, I don't feel like that's enough haircuts, you know? I really don't. Oh god, <laughs> I tried to run. <laughs> I tried to run so hard. I think I need to get some better positioning for my team. Because I ain't going too well so far. I love that voice clip because to me, it, to me, it sounds like the squid is saying "bloody hell," <laughs> which is like a Ron Weasley line in my mind. Um, but every time I hear it, that's all I can think. And then I think about Ron going like "bloody hell." It's funny. Oh god, I'm scared. Oh god, I'm really scared. <laughs> Just ran into you. 
Just bonk. <laughs> Knocked the, the brush back. Dang it. We're not doing amazingly. I mean, you three are obviously exceptionally skilled players, so... I can only do so much, you know? I'm just trying to dance around as much as possible. No. <laughs> I just got Splat Bomb and Booyah Bomb comboed, which is very powerful. We're all dead. Everyone is dead. Everyone dead. Do, 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 do. Yeah, this this didn't go as well as <laughs> could have done without that death at the end there, but that's okay. <laughs> Just could not break through the enemy lines. Too much defense and too much range. We had a 96 gal. Why weren't they getting the kills? They got two kills. Ooh, I leveled up. 41 star. <laughs> Let's go again. <laughs> Feel your pain. I know you have been on the, the lonely side of the team a few times. That's okay. I feel like it shouldn't have put me with the level 20s. I feel like there was an imbalance. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Scared me so much when you bumped into me with the brush. <laughs> I got scared. Like you don't expect it with, when you're zooming around to bump into someone. Um. Like, you just don't expect it at all. Alright, Skipper Pavilion. Uh-oh, <laughs> not again. <laughs> it's Apple Love as well. They're like, a good player, from what I can tell. Oh, and I've got two chargers. Hmm, interesting. So we've got two chargers and two short range, so there's a sploosh. I forget what set that sploosh has. I don't think it's the one I normally use, which is the curling bomb one. So, I'm not sure. Might be the one with the hammer. Oh god, splat bombs. It's so stressful. Like, it's so stressful. Run away! <laughs> I feel like I've been trapped into this corner. So I'm just gonna make a little run for it. Run! Oh my gosh. One! Ah, ah, ah. That was okay. I activated my armor and then I went for it and I got a kill. That was fine. You know, I, I, I can deal with that. I don't feel bad about that. I don't feel bad about that at all, actually. Uh-oh. I see the washing machine, I run. <laughs> it's just how I roll. Literally, because I am using a ruler class weapon. Oh, feels bad. Man, I love tent missiles. Tent missiles are so good. I feel like I'm just gonna get stuck with this person over here, but I do need to try and ink our side of the field, so... Yeah, here it comes. The bombs and the... <laughs> The booyahs, yep. It's happening. Oh god! <laughs> no! <laughs> I booped you and everything. That was so funny. That was a huge boop. Man, can we like party for 50 seconds? Because I'm not like winning this game. Please, no hurt. I come in peace. Look, I'm gonna draw a heart on the floor. You ready? Eh. Eh. Beautiful! Join me in my heart of love! Yeah! <laughs> I mean, I'm not winning this, so... I feel like my teammates probably hate me, but I don't actually know where they are, so I think we're okay. Oh, here we go! 
No! My heart! So rude! You ruined my heart! <laughs> Hold on. Let me do another heart. <laughs> the worst! <laughs> no! <laughs> so rude! Yeah, we just weren't winning that. I don't know why. Uh, I, don't, don't even, I don't even think we had a draw fight. Um, I just don't think the Chargers were killing people, so... Well, they, they killed one person each, I guess, but pfft, that was definitely a lost cause. <laughs> that, that was not happening at all for us. All right, we're going again. Boop. We're going to probably make this the last one, friends, and then we'll be done for today. Fingers crossed we can get on the same team. That would be real nice. That'd be lovely and happy and it would be great and... Yeah, last round. Um, and then I'll sign off for the day. Man, it's gotten so dark. I need to put more lights on. There we go. Slightly better. Because I have like my main light for my face. And then I have like other lights. Although this room doesn't have a ceiling light, so I rely on lamps. So the lighting in here is really weird all the time. But yeah. <laughs> Please game. <laughs> oh, Roxy's face just cracks me up every time. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Like, it just makes me giggle. All right, well, it's 2v2. Short range weapons unite. <laughs> we can do it, possibly. Man, I keep forgetting to throw my sprinkler out. I guess I'll just put it there. Get a special weapon or a special ability going. I got one hit on someone. Not enough though. Ah, oh, dang it. I couldn't get them for you. I tried. <laughs> oh no, that's a dynamo roller. Come on, Charger, you can do it. This is what you're made for. This is literally what you're made for. Dynamo rulers. Come on. Nope. Man, these splat bombs are like doing my head in today. <laughs> they are everywhere all the time. All right. Let's try and command this little point here. Trying to dodge these tent missiles. Jeez. Got him. Good job. I'm trying to bait out whoever's here. I feel like someone's hiding, but I don't want to actually see the. Oh no. <laughs> that was a real good splat bomb. <laughs> Got two of us. Alright, let's see what's going on over here. Pink is what's going on. We don't want that. We want green. See, this is like fluorescent green, right? So some people would call fluorescent green yellow. You know how you get like high layers and stuff and it's yellow, but some people say green. Oh, splat bombs, man. It's so brutal. Oh, I couldn't dodge. The ink was too much. Okay. Um, let me... I need to do something quite drastic here, so... Alright, good. Good job, that was a nice hammer. We like that hammer. Just doing some cleanup over here. Yes! Man, Apple Love, I feel like, is a really good squid. <laughs> like, good at the game squid. Oh, that's a dynamo roller. <laughs> I really cannot get close. Hey, the charger got him. Good job, charger. Wow, that was like, not going good and then we won. So, yes. Oh, big stretch. Nice. 
Whew. Like high vis, yes. Because that's yellow, but I can understand people saying green. But this is green. This is the difference. Firefin? Lucky Firefin. Give me that sub saver. Not on the- on Perry. Oh, for... Getting trolled by the game. <laughs> oh. oh well, I'm- I don't think I made any improvements with my brush towards orange flag. In fact, I think I lost, but that's okay. I still had fun. Um, so, um, thanks for playing. That was really fun to be able to play with some of you. Appreciate it. it's like during the week, so might be easier to spoon on weekends. Um, I can't believe I got that sub saver <laughs> instead of on here. Oh well, that's okay. Um, let me go and sit on the skateboard ramp. That would be good. Yeah, it's a shame we never all got on the same team. I guess it's just luck, um, literally. So next time we shall see. Let me position myself nicely. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> um, so I think we're gonna do ranked Splatoon on Thursday. So that'll be me trying to get better at whatever mode it is. I don't think it'll tell me that far in advance. Um, but I am rank X in everything now, which is really cool. This is the first month I've been able to place in all of uh, rank X's and I, I didn't do too well. Most of my placement matches were kind of rubbish. Um, so I want to actively try and improve as opposed to just doing my 10 placement matches every month because I feel like that's not really playing ranked. Um, so I'd, I'd like to try and improve. I'd like to try and get 2200 on every mode, which I think I already have in tower control because that's the mode that I'm best at. Um, but I definitely don't have it in Rainmaker or Clan Blitz because Rainmaker I am bad at and Clan Blitz I just had some really unfortunate placements. So yeah, I think we're, we're going to have like a, a hardcore get better at Splatoon where I play ranked on Thursday. And then on Saturday we'll do some Salmon Run, which I checked and there is Salmon Run on. So if anyone's around on Saturday, we can play some Salmon Run together and that will be really nice because I think Salmon Run is always better when you play with people who you know are somewhat competent. Um, that doesn't necessarily mean like you have to be amazing at Salmon Run, but just knowing the kind of basics of actually cooperating with the team and, you know, inking the floor instead of getting shot up in the air on the... Um, <laughs> the egg basket, which I agree is very fun. But when you're going into round three and the place is a mess and someone's like going pew into the air, that really grinds my gears. That's not for me. <laughs> so um, I think we'll do some salmon on a Saturday because hopefully more people are around on Saturday. And then on Sunday, we will do the big finale of New Leaf. And I'm excited to show you my tang because when we last left off with Animal Crossing, we were just coming into winter. So I have had the whole winter um, to work on things. I wouldn't say that I've managed to do everything I'd like to, but I think the town's looking really nice. And I'm happy to leave it off in its current state. So we'll, we'll talk about that and make plans for New Horizons on Sunday. And then next week will kind of be like a mishmash of things. So... I'll have to put more thought into next week, but this week we're just going to binge Sploon because I like Sploon. Um, and then on Sunday we'll do the, the Lily Cove wrap up. On New Leaf, can we come visit? Yeah, possibly. Um, I can open the town up. I, I need to update my dream suite, but I'll do it um, just before the stream starts so that you can't take a sneaky peek at my town. Um, so yeah, maybe we could invite whoever is around in and we'll have like a little party before we actually say goodbye that might be quite fun um but for today i'm gonna go so um thanks for watching and playing splatoon with me that was fun you're very good splatoon players so it's it's nice to kind of interact with people who are good at the game um because you can kind of laugh about it and it's just pretty chill so 
yeah thanks for watching and i will say goodbye for now and i'll see you hopefully on thursday and if not later in the week okay cool <laughs> roxy's face every time makes me laugh <laughs> all right i'll see you later everyone lots of love take care bye bye